welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Aircrack Eng is a popular suite of tools used for testing the security of Wi-Fi networks. It is widely recognized in the cybersecurity community for its effectiveness and versatility. It's a go-to for security professionals and ethical hackers. These experts rely on Aircrack Eng to ensure that their networks are secure and to identify potential vulnerabilities before they can be exploited by malicious actors. Aircrack Eng helps you find weaknesses in your own networks, allowing you to fix them before someone with bad intentions can exploit them. Aircrack Eng is very powerful. It provides a comprehensive suite of tools that can be used to perform a variety of tasks related to network security. It can be used to assess different security aspects of Wi-Fi. This includes everything from monitoring network traffic to analyzing the strength and integrity of encryption protocols. This includes monitoring network traffic, which is crucial for identifying unusual or potentially malicious activity on your network. Analyzing weaknesses in encryption protocols like WEP and WPA slash WPA2, which are commonly used to secure Wi-Fi networks. Understanding these weaknesses can help you choose the best encryption method for your network, and even attempting to crack passwords. This can be useful for testing the strength of your own passwords, and ensuring that they are not easily guessable by attackers. Understanding how to use air cracking gives you valuable insights into the world of wireless security. It equips you with the knowledge and skills needed to protect your network from a variety of threats. This guide is designed for beginners, and we will walk you through the fundamental steps. By the end of this tutorial, you will have a solid understanding of how to use air cracking effectively. You'll learn how to use air cracking on a Kali Linux system. Kali Linux is a powerful operating system that is widely used in the cybersecurity community. Kali Linux is a special operating system designed for penetration testing and ethical hacking. It comes preloaded with a variety of tools, including Aircrack Eng, making it an ideal platform for learning and practicing network security techniques. It comes with Aircrack Eng pre installed, so you can get started right away without having to worry about installation and setup. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. The tools and techniques you will learn should only be used for ethical purposes. Using Aircrack Eng to access networks without permission is illegal and unethical. Always ensure that you have explicit permission before testing any network. Only use these tools on networks you own or have explicit permission to test. This ensures that you are acting within the bounds of the law and maintaining ethical standards in your cybersecurity practices. To follow along with this guide, you'll need a computer running Kali Linux. Kali Linux is a powerful, Debian-based Linux distribution designed for digital forensics and penetration testing. It's packed with hundreds of tools that can help you in various cybersecurity tasks. You can download Kali Linux from the official website and install it on a virtual machine or a spare computer. The installation process is straightforward and the website provides detailed instructions to guide you through each step. Whether you choose to install it on a virtual machine or a dedicated system, make sure your hardware meets the minimum requirements. Kali Linux comes pre-packaged with Aircrack Eng, a suite of tools for auditing wireless networks. This means you won't have to worry about installing it separately. Aircrack Eng is one of the most popular tools for network security professionals and enthusiasts alike. However, you will need a wireless adapter that supports monitor mode. Monitor mode is essential for capturing packets from wireless networks, which is a critical step in the process of network auditing and penetration testing. Monitor mode is a special setting that allows your wireless adapter to listen to all Wi-Fi traffic in the vicinity, not just traffic intended for your computer. This capability is crucial for tasks such as packet sniffing and network analysis. Not all wireless adapters support monitor mode, so you may need to purchase a compatible one. It's important to do some research to find an adapter that is known to work well with Kali Linux and supports monitor mode. Many online forums and communities can provide recommendations based on their experiences. Once you have Kali Linux up and running and you have a compatible wireless adapter plugged in, you're ready to start exploring the world of Aircrackung. This powerful tool will allow you to test the security of wireless networks, helping you to identify vulnerabilities and improve your network's defenses. The first step in using Aircrack Ong is to put your wireless adapter into monitor mode. Think of monitor mode as turning your wireless adapter into a Wi-Fi surveillance device. 
It allows your computer to capture all Wi-Fi traffic within range, not just data packets specifically addressed to it. To enable monitor mode, you'll use the command, a part of the Aircrack Eng suite. First, you need to identify your wireless interface. You can do this with the command. Look for the name of your wireless interface. It's usually something like OR. Once you know the name of your wireless interface, you can enable monitor mode using the following command, replacing with your actual interface name. Section 5. Scanning for Wireless Networks With your wireless adapter in monitor mode, you're ready to start scanning for Wi-Fi networks. Aircrackening provides a tool called for this purpose, captures all Wi-Fi packets in the air and displays useful information about nearby networks. To start scanning, open a new terminal window and type the following command, again replacing with the name of your monitor mode interface. You'll see a screen filled with information about Wi-Fi networks within range. This information includes the network name, or SSID, signal strength, encryption type, like WEP, WPA, or WPA2, MAC address, also known as BSSID, and the channel. You can use this information to identify the network you want to target. Section 6. Targeting and Capturing the Handshake To crack a Wi-Fi password, you need to capture a handshake. A handshake occurs when a device connects to a Wi-Fi network. It's a series of messages exchanged between the device and the router that verifies the password. To increase your chances of capturing a handshake, you can use another tool in the Aircrack Enyang suite to send de-authentication packets. These packets temporarily disconnect devices from the network, forcing them to reconnect and generate a fresh handshake. However, keep in mind that de-authentication attacks can be disruptive. Only perform them on networks you own or have permission to test. Section 7. Cracking the Password, a Dictionary-Based Approach Once you have captured a handshake, you can attempt to crack the password using Uses a dictionary attack, which involves trying a list of words from a file called a word list. Word lists contain common passwords and can be found online. To start cracking, use the following command, replacing with the name of your capture file, with the path to your word list, and with the target network's best side. If a password in the word list matches the one used by the Wi-Fi network, we'll display it. Keep in mind that cracking a strong password can take a long time, even with a good word list. Section 8. Troubleshooting and Common Issues Using Aircrack Ung can sometimes be tricky, especially for beginners. You might encounter issues with drivers, monitor mode, or capturing handshakes. Don't get discouraged. The Aircrack Ung website and online forums are valuable resources for troubleshooting. One common issue is incompatible drivers. Make sure you're using a wireless adapter that's known to work well with Kali Linux and supports monitor mode. You can find lists of compatible adapters online. Another common issue is failing to capture a handshake. Try sending more de-authentication packets or waiting for a longer period. Remember, capturing a handshake requires patience and persistence. Section 9. Continuing your journey in wireless security. This guide provides a basic introduction to using Aircrack Ung for Wi-Fi security testing. There's much more to learn and explore in the world of wireless security. Aircrack Ung is a powerful tool with many advanced features and options. To deepen your knowledge, consult the official Aircrack Ung documentation. It's a comprehensive resource covering all aspects of the tool. Additionally, numerous online resources, tutorials, and courses can help you become a proficient ethical hacker. Remember, ethical hacking is a continuous learning process. Stay curious, keep experimenting, and always prioritize ethical considerations. By using your knowledge responsibly, you can contribute to making the digital world a safer place.